good evening friends <coughs> this is a very short talk <coughs> on a very unusual treatment modality called block and walk which is a new method for treating intertrochanteric fractures we all know that the prognosis of trochanteric fractures operated or otherwise is very poor with as much as 60% mortality at the end of one year you can see 50% never recover fully 20% die within a year 30% have permanent disability and 40% are unable to walk independently after surgery in a very large international trial dhs pfn or spica does not heal an it fracture walking does this is our invention which is a new method of treating intertrochanteric fractures by a beta 6 block you can see a patient with an intertrochanteric fracture stable type only thing here is we have to inform the patient that the patient must be willing to accept 1 to 1 and 1/2 inches of shortening beta 6 portal is lateral to the femoral nerve into the inguinal crease going through the inguinal ligament just below the inguinal ligament we palpate the neurovascular bundle and one finger breadth away laterally we inject 0.5% xylocaine 30 microgram clonidine and a total volume of 4 to 6 milliliters this is a high risk patient with cabg triple vessel block and lot of cost of comorbidities had even a cardiac surgery in the past unfit for surgery you can see immediately after the injection within 10 minutes the patient who was moribund and immobile for a period of 24 hours after she slipped from a bathroom is able to stand up and walk most people especially the younger surgeons ask me how will this fracture unite if you don't fix it for them i need to add that fractures do not unite by fixation fractures unite by nature and callus reaching the fracture site here in just 10 minutes after the injection supported by three people a totally horizontal patient has been made vertical the blocks take close to 20 minutes to have effect presently the patient is having a little pain so we wait for another 10 minutes by now the block has totally had the effect and here the patient is trying to keep her feet on the ground and she is able to start putting weight on the fracture we can see the lighting behind so you know the timing of the day this was done early in the day time today i think about 9 9:30 am in the morning and we can see that within 30 minutes of injection the patient is walking comfortably compressing and loading the fracture the nurse is holding her only to give support and ensure that she does not trip and fall with time her pain will come down dramatically and hopefully by the evening this has been taken later in the evening you can see the change in the light it's almost 8 hours since the block and the patient is a little more comfortable walking a little more confidently and the last x ray taken just at the evening today will show you 
how independently the patient is walking on her trochanteric fracture all we now need to do is to repeat these blocks every 5 days for four or five times we do not use any steroids in the block block contains of only 0.5% xylocaine and 30 microgram clonidine as the ideal sodium channel blockers and i have assured this patient that she will have a union of the fracture in less than 90 days her morbidity expenses and trouble will be far lesser than any dhs condylar plate hip spica or of course the dreaded pfn which is an implant i really hate and she will lead a normal life if you are interested in joining the pain portal course please message me in whatsapp on this number and you can be enrolled indian academy of orthopedic surgeons is very proud to present revolutionary new ideas in orthopedics which are not only game changers but will rewrite the textbooks thank you very much thank you